Good afternoon. Day two of my blog. Just an update. Uh, you see the uh, tooth I'm wearing? I got that from Sait. I was uh, going to college there back in the mid-90s. I was taking a recreational course, looking after pools, arenas, golf courses, uh, parks, etc. And I got a job and in the uh, field. Uh, and I was working at a Waterside Park, the first year I got out of school, and that was quite a challenge trying to run a Waterside Park and needed a lot of work, and seeing they were always having a challenge trying to keep the place running properly there, and dealing with health inspectors and people like that, and we managed to keep it going anyways there for the summer, and that was the end of that. They closed down. They never did open up after that. There was just too much wrong with the place. The uh, board finally blew up at the end, so I guess the owner didn't want to... Uh, spend the money, so he just walked out and left the place, so it finally got sold, and new owners never did use, and they ended up making it into a campground. So, out of the bathroom we go. And I just got today's paper, and on the front headlines it says record dip in temperatures. It shows some of the uh, accidents that happened, and I got the snowfall, left the road, and flipped over its side, and another car flipped over its side on the Trans Canada near here, and so uh, today the roads are fine, I was out today, so we're going to uh, go downstairs and do the latest update on my car, oh, before we do that, I'm going to talk about these, uh, anybody remembers these Beer balls here, these uh, old Heidelbergs. Yeah, the old barrel shaped Heidelbergs from the 70s. Yeah, a few years ago, I had a case there, and so instead of returning them back to the depot, I decided to make them into uh, glasses. So I, so I've got uh, four sitting here in the kitchen window, and I got the rest scattered around the house, some downstairs and and some still put away yet. And here's the latest on the kitchen cabinets. This morning, I decided to do another one on the left-hand side of the sink and on the right-hand side of the sink. So all my stuff is sitting on the kitchen floor waiting for it to dry. More by the stove. Now we'll go downstairs. Another thing I got to deal with there is the uh, washing machine. The uh, knob that controls the speed had broken off, so I can't use that anymore. So it's on the slow speed, and uh, if I can find a used one somewhere, I'll go and put it in. And be able to get back and then now this knob is screwed up so you can't turn it so I've got to turn it by reaching on the back part and turning it this way. So that's kind of a nuisance too you got to do that but uh, if I find another one there because I guess it broke off and I can see the plastic snapped off the knob and, but at least you can still get behind it and, and turn it. So we'll go outside. I had it out today. I was going to get my insurance yesterday. So here I did. Here's my Lewis sticker I got on here. Yeah, good till September 23rd, 2011. So I had it out for first drive today. It ran great. And uh, another thing I did to it there was replace the uh, thermostat in there because the temperature goes zero. So last fall when I was doing all the work on the car, I had to take this uh, surge tank off. And way down underneath here, where my hand is, is where it connects on the thermostat. It's right in there. The, front part of the motor, so I had to take that off, 
didn't change the thermostat. You might be able to see it there. The sun is shining pretty good today. It's a beautiful sunny day out, but still cold and windy. So, I took that out for a drive, and it ran great, and the temperature went right up to normal now, right up to the middle of the gauge, so I was happy with that. And I guess that's it for today's vlog, so have a great day. Bye for now.